Today on the Bob Carey Pedestrian Bridge between Omaha and Council Bluffs, city leaders and victims of domestic violence gathered to mark the beginning of Child Abuse Awareness Month. Reporter Shannon Wilson has the story. Blue and silver pinwheels spin in the chilly wind Saturday morning, decorating the sidewalks leading up to the pedestrian bridge connecting Nebraska and Iowa. Omaha Mayor Gene Stother and Council Bluffs Mayor Matt Walsh joined together in the middle of Bob Carey Pedestrian Bridge to proclaim April as Child Abuse Prevention Month. And it's the next generation and it's important kids grow up healthy and educated and ready to be citizens that contribute to their communities. To Tina Clark, this month means much more. Uh, she was 28 days old when she was shaken by her bio biological father. Tina's daughter, Madison DeYoung, died in 2003 after being shaken by her father. Tina joined the Shaken Baby Task Force to tell her story and prevent the same from happening to any other child. I just want to um, educate the public and make it aware, you know, that this is um, a sad thing that kids go through. Prevent Child Abuse, Pottawatomie County, which promotes programs and services towards effective child development, joined alongside the Shaken Baby Task Force to raise awareness of child abuse and neglect. The Pinwheels for Prevention campaign promotes the pinwheel as a national symbol for child abuse prevention. They're our future parents, so I think it's very important to educate them on what to do when they can't get the baby to stop crying. They could have an infant in their home. They could be a babysitter, but they're our future parents. Shannon Wilson, KMTV Action 3 News.